A Parkinson's diagnosis can be devastating at any age, and especially for someone who's on the younger side. One Portland man decided it would not define him, however. And as Jenny Hansen shows us in tonight's Positive Vibes, he's in the best shape of his life and training for an international event. Feeling good. Between machines. Nice, good balance. And the water. Let's go three-quarter slide on the next one. Todd Vogt trains 12 times a week. He's been rowing for decades and has rowed in national championships. Started rowing freshman year of college. Uh, I pretty much never really stopped. Three. Four. But a couple of years ago, Todd felt off. In fall of 2017, when I was preparing for a rowing competition, a big rowing competition, I started noticing I was really fatigued, much more fatigued than I normally was. I noticed also like my performance just was decreasing, like my times on the rowing machines were decreasing, even though I was training quite a bit. Less than a year later, Todd was diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. It was pretty uh, devastating at first. Uh, one of the first things I thought was, you know, I was definitely not going to be a competitive rower anymore. But then he began working out again. My fitness started to improve a little bit. He was invited to race on the national team last summer, and now he's training to try and land a spot on the Paralympic team that will travel to Tokyo in the summer of 2020. Todd's neurologist at OHSU, Dr. Ron Pfeiffer, says what Todd is doing on the water is almost certainly having a positive effect on his health. People with Parkinson's disease who exercise do better for longer. Uh, there's even some data in animal literature uh, that would suggest that, that uh, exercise may alter progression of Parkinson's, slow progression of Parkinson's. You know, there are times when I just want to like lay on the couch and, you know, just watch TV, but sometimes I think it's good to try to get beyond that and try to like live my life and, you know, hopefully others can do that too. There is no cure for Parkinson's, but Todd is doing his part to slow its progression one stroke at a time. Nice. They're flying. Jenny Hansen, Coin 6 News. What an inspirational story. Now, Todd will go to a camp in June, and that's when he will find out if he qualified for the Tokyo Paralympics, which started late August and go through early September. We wish him the best of luck. Absolutely.